Hi, I'm Neil Perkellis, and I just filmed half of my vlog without hitting the record button first. So today I want to talk about willpower. My biggest fear in college is that I won't have the willpower that I want to succeed and be the person that I want to be. For the past month, all I've been asking my friends and people that I know who are in college is this one question. You study how much? And the worst part of it all is that I was a huge procrastinator in high school, to an extreme level. Luckily, this summer I got a job, uh, and it's been a full-time job, so I've been working quite a lot. And uh, I think it's good for me, because I've developed this work hard, play hard attitude, because I go to work first every day, and then I come home and I relax. And hopefully that has sort of changed my mentality for college. But unfortunately, college brings new challenges and new distractions that I must face. I just hope that when I get back home, I'm not that changed of a person. And if I am, it's for the better, like this. Hello, Mother. Hello, Father. I'm back from the university with straight-A pluses. And not like this. What up, Mom? What up, Dad? I'm back from college! What? Everyone says you change in college, but I kind of like who I am right now. Minus the lack of willpower part. But if that changes, I'm worried, you know, what else is going to change about me? There's probably going to be two parts of me in college. There's going to be the part of me that wants to have fun, go out, go to clubs, go to parties, all that sort of fun stuff. And then there's going to be the part of me that wants to be a great student and do well on tests and study all the time. And I don't know how that's going to mesh very well at all. Let's go to a party. I need to study. Party. Study. Stop. Study. Dad is sleeping upstairs. Let's put shaving cream in his hand. Oh, gosh. I mean, it's almost as if, at some point, if I'm not doing well at something because I'm not studying hard enough, the studying student part of me should slap the other version of me. Check me. Bruh. Man, bruh. On second thought, I would not want to slap myself. But I have made it this far, and without much struggle. I mean, there's always that one day where you're pounding everything in and studying super hard for the test that's tomorrow. And I feel like that's gonna still be me, but I did that pretty well in high school. I just might need to up my game in college. At least that's my hope. Nothing in life that's worth it is ever easy as I like to put it, and so this is not going to be easy. But at the same time, I hope that I can have fun with it. Thanks for watching my video. If you liked it, click the like button somewhere down here. And if you want to subscribe, you can click the subscribe button somewhere, somewhere. On Wednesday, we'll have another Edible Interviews interviewing myself, Adrian, will be interviewing me. This, in my opinion, is the best one that we have. It is hilarious. I would recommend watching it. And then next Sunday, we will have Adrian doing his first vlog. He told, <clears throat> excuse me, I burped. He told me it would be something having to do with summer and how it's changed him. We'll see. Who knows? Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And I will see you next week. Not next week. Three weeks from now.